Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your weekly read. This week, this reading will go from June 10th through the 16th, 2019. Um, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. I've already pulled some cards. Thank you to those who've already, who do so and already done so. Anyhow, um, Pisces, it just looks like a week of heavy week. A heavy week of defending yourself. Either way it goes, you're going to look like the bad guy. You're going to look like the bad person. I don't know if that's a true narrative that you are the bad guy. Sometimes we do play the bad guy. But a double confirmation on the five of swords. We get two five of swords here. Nine of Wands, Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, Two, Five of Swords, Five of Wands, and then the Five of Pentacles. Clarify. Nothing but fives. I think you had all four of them, right? No. I did get the Five of Cups. I think you're over it emotionally. <clears throat> this is a Piscean person coming to the realization that maybe a marriage or something long-standing, it could be something to do with job and corporation is over that you may have to start from you fill in the blank that you may have to start over that there's not a win-win situation that you know if if it's love and romance then both parties will suffer some hardship I think in the midst of being separated from something or someone you found true clarity true philosophy of your own life in regards to how you feel about a situation and it, and it might be in regards to something or a relationship you've been in for a very long time you now have a a sense of uh, what to do next of what action to take next um there also is a piscean person who this might have been a love affair so there's more than one party this might be a Piscean person playing with two ideas of how to make money, stay with the corporation, or go out on your own. Um, there, there's a Piscean person who has suffered suffered significant change in something long-standing, a union, a marriage, some dynamic in your life that is institutional. Um, something's changed where you feel left out. I don't know if you had to go. If you got demoted, if you if you now know that a relationship is just not working, um, you have lack of confidence in in forward movement. Um, there's opposing idea or opinion in regards to what how you should move and what you should do. It looks like you're you're remaining emotionally um, stable in regards to all of this all of this um, change there might be jealousy and resentment here with a particular person in a sense they will try to block you It says that you there there might have been a sense of fear of commitment in regards to starting something new and ending one way. So you, you, you play both sides, but now you're at a place where you have to choose. Or significant changes happen so much that it it just isn't um it's not feasible to stay where you are. It says womanly advice, feminine advice, good advice comes to you by some woman. Hidden talents are now revealed in regards to maybe how you make money. For some of you, it's you know your your, your creative endeavors. Get more information, definitely. Listen to your intuition. The high priest is here. The bottom of the deck.
you had not been making a decision in regards to two parties or two things or whatever because of your fear of commitment. Big happy changes. Yep. Ask others for help. I think in the absence of someone that you really like or love, you understand that 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 person makes you happy and you want to now make the necessary change. Big happy changes. And there might have been romance between the two of you, but also drama, childlike games played. It's a love affair, so there may even be mental games played here. There's someone standing in the way of. Um, let me get you some advice to close out. Or some what you should be focused on moving forward. Family changes. It talks about uh, someone moving out of the home. A home move, a divorce, a separation, a new baby. Uh, this could be anything. Someone coming back to the home. Um, anything that constitutes the family change. A child leaving the home for the first time. Or bringing a baby home. A new dog, a pet. You know. All of those things. So family changes big happy changes okay so Pisces I hope that this helped you out in regards to your situation um, if you feel like you need a personal reading all the links are below make sure you use coupon code 10 on 35 at the website if you do book your own personal reading Pisces know that I'm praying for you pray for me as well take care bye